Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever you're watching us from. Welcome to National Space. Much has been happening actually in and around the compound, and we have a very amazing episode lined up for you. So let's start the show. So a Gen Z, a Gen Z, we have a Gen Z is this generation that we are in right now, but if you don't know our generation, I'll be taking you through it. So first generation is greatest generation. So greatest generation, these are people born from 1901 to 1924. Then we have the silent generation, which was 1925 to 1945. I think some of our parents want to follow her. Parents or grandparents? Then we have the big boomers. 1946 in 1964. Hey, Badu. 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 Yes. <laughs> <laughs> then we move down to Generation X. Generation X is people from 1965 to 1980. Ah, those are my parents. Sorry. Oh, for real. Then we have millennials. The millennials now they are from born 1981 1996. Mm -hmm. These are people who are, who are not raised with internet. And these are people who 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 want to understand. Want to talk here, Sana? Yeah. Especially my sister. Calling us my sister, but generation. Chebet mazewo na nikazi ya Sana. Then we have the Gen Z. We are the ones. Born from 1997 to 2012. Do you know something about this generation? Mm -hmm. They were born. They were they were raised with internet, mm -hmm. and you can't tell them shit. Then you have now the gener generation alpha, born between 20, 2013 to 2025. These now are now children of Gen Z, of Gen Z. Are you sure they're Gen Z's children? Yeah. They're people, they're generation X who are still giving birth to... I thought you were baby boomers. Okay. I thought you were baby boomers. I thought you were silent. Ah, wrong, go ahead. Baby boomers? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah, maybe Baba Mzee and Mzee and Oh yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so we are all Gen Z's people. So we are raised with the internet and there is this pressure that is that the society is giving us Gen Z's because right now it's like your adulthood and it's not the way we expected. I'm an adulthood the way you expect right now. Yeah, it's something. Oh, I thought was squeezy. Oh, I thought was squeezy. You know, mommy, I'm not going to touch. I'm machine that you can see. Oh, you can chat too. And dance, dance, TikTok, dance, TikTok. I don't know how these people will understand that we are doing this, man. We are raised with the internet. You know, you have to, you have to acknowledge the fact that when you mess them, there are so many different generations. You get. So they somehow they had expectations that just as it was for them, it's going to be for us. Which is actually not. Exactly, it's a shock for them. And I don't know how long it will take for them to accept the fact that we are very different. At Unajua Katieto at Soma Library, we were being given assignments. We were going to the library. To do we this. were sourcing for books. But nowadays, just I give you assignment, me. you go to chat and feed. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's I think it's an advantage and also a disadvantage yes, of being a Gen Z because of AI. You know, we are we are the we are kind of people who don't work, who don't, who don't like a lot of work. Yeah, AI will be like say they are crazy, but AI is coming and that replace the game in society. Uh, yeah, it is not a good thing. So, guys, so Gen Z, so these are facts about Gen Z that we I, I want us to talk about. Okay, mm -hmm. so first of all, Gen Z. Wait, they are not facts; they are assumptions. Yeah. The assumptions. Those are assumptions you really? want to tell us. Those are not facts. <laughs> okay, so let's go. <laughs> so, Gen Z tends to be lazy at their workplace. Facts? Not all, but most. I must agree, most. Yeah. You know, at their work, me, me, I, 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 I tend to work with people who are who are my age mates and we are all Gen Z's. And these people are never serious. These are the people who you tell them, okay, assignment in a submitter at 2. 
you'll find them at 159 trying now to assignment ni kwa kitu assignment ni kwa gani when you come to work una pay a to deadline cash or okay can you can you try to to extend the i also yeah. saw this meme by kenya memes and a gz and it was interview and as okay, i can't make it can we do it <laughs> can we chat and not tell me what chat can we do it online my opinion that's true by the way by the fact that we tend to take most of our time uh, in technology personally at my workplace unapata ngao manzi usiku yote umenunua bags za wana ama kwa kwa wifi kwa hapo umeshinda tu tiktok pale eh umeshinda youtube alafu hiyo place ukifika manzi usiku una saiki ya kufanya kazi uko tu hapo tu nagawa shamba so i think it's a fact and i think we are blessed we both were millennials wa wa baby boomers na kuti we are not working we are not working you are very lazy huh? Unapatiwa kazi yote kidogo umefika kwa computer. No but then again Gen Z I feel like wanapenda ku move in crowds. Unajua unaweza pata kuna like just a, a, for example it's a group of 20 and 10 people are lazy, right? And then there's the 10 remaining. So there's the five who will be like okay I'm going to do this. Then the remaining five will be like ah Now that the 10 are lazy, let's join them. Just let's just do it. It's, it's what is cool right now. Let's just act lazy. I feel like not everybody is lazy. They just do it because everyone else is doing it. Or they do it so that they can go and complain online. So, oh my God. Yesterday at work, this boss was bothering me. You want to do so hard? No, no, no. It's not everybody. It's not everybody. I feel like some people are naturally lazy, which is which is okay yeah, because yeah. they work around. But you see, a lot of us are lazy. That, that. I'm not lazy, so... They try just to, to, to I'm not trying. I'm I am not lazy. It mean for me Miss if Alina is not too lazy. much I'm lazy. But if I get necessary motivation lakini kuna vitu zingine tunafika ngama pema. Buda sewa ku pin location of the Buda city. Sevi wa mbetu go to ngong right now. Ngong. Kuna form. Naivasha mimi ndio tu ile kesho lakini mimi nishapa kwa mzao leo. Exactly. Kwanza nataka tu kelewe usiku. Okay, another one. Gen Z doesn't know and care about profession language. I was in class the other time. I was in class and there was this 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 lady who was now I could scare the lecturer what was asking and I was like like can you repeat the question? Like can you Mr. Muliza? You know they don't know that courtesy of you know when when this other generation was come okay, excuse me sir, can you repeat the question? But Gen Z, what did you say like it's not giving There was this conference that was in and this lady was now was was uh, an opportunity to stand and ask something. He was like, "You know what? This one is not giving." And you are talking to the they were barbers and you are telling them this is not giving. You know, you know that that time that nani came and I was like I was like and no one was understanding them. Yeah. What's your take on that? Uh my take is uh, to me share to me those lines. That assumption is true. Basically, when you trace back to the originality of language mostly shen hata tushen zile za mtaani you find that hata ukienda pale sokoni ama hata ukikwa pale stage huyo uko ndaka atakuuliza eh brother unaenda eh sisi unaenda na wale wale si they are not gen z they are millennials unaona so in their language they tend to use the the pronouns these are pronouns kama brother sister hata kama it's not on a professional level but look at our kuna kuna gen z ana tumeje na brother ni ngumu sana. Ni ngumu sana. Mbona wewe mtu mtu? Sikio hata unajua ukitoa bro, bro, hiyo ni madharau. Kwanza demo, akute bro, hiyo ni madharau. Unajua ni madharau. Ni madharau. Wacha ku bro zone. Demo ku bro zone. Let me let me tell you guys a secret on camera. If a girl, I'm sorry lady. If a girl is like calling you bro all the time. Trust me. You have a chance. Sorry. You have a chance to you know get ah. to know her better. Are you sure what the blossoming kutoko ni ngumu sana? I feel like you you guys came up with the blossoming thing. There's nothing like blossom, there's nothing okay. Na there is friend zone, but there is no blossom. Sasa unaona kuna friend zone. Alafu ukitoka friend zone kwa hiyo kwa hiyo food chain, kwa hiyo triangle iko sasa hapo chini. Actually hapo sasa uweze toka blossom it's the same thing. Hata hii friend zone Everybody 
Please rewind. Love. Love is... What about you? Man, no love. Dating is not your thing. But self-acceptance is the key. Jikubani sina pesa. Watana na mambo ya mapenzi. Hauna pesa ndugu yangu na unataka kwenda kuzamisha, unataka kwenda kufanya nani. But money is not the only thing you're benefiting from. Money is not the only benefit you're getting from. But right now. Let me tell you something. There's so much you benefit in that relationship. What can you benefit from? Right now you can also get sex with getting into a not just sex is not what. Not just sex. But they have something with this this they're having sex like this a basic need. Kwanza kuna kitu inaitwa FWB. Friends with benefits. That thing is very dangerous. And it's misused. You know, chana na. You know, sasa ndiyo. Your friend with benefits are only calling you and this. Moto. I mean... The lady in the room. Young people. Chichete. Sio mimi na chichete. Na chichete wenye. Juhu nyinyi, you are against friends with benefits. And I want to speak for what we are friends with benefits. Let me tell you. If you get into a relationship so you can just have sex with one person. That's... A faulty relationship. That's not a relationship. So I feel like that's why we have we have uh, rappers. You rap it oh, before I'm you rap it before you tap it. Exactly. Rap it before you. Rap it before you tap it. Who says we are done? <laughs> because are just... so friends with benefits. Oh, for you to catch feelings. There is so much in life to do that you should not involve But I think something, something about you see, they don't know about, you know, sex, when, when you're having sex even with friends with benefits and telling that person to not have feelings, the moment you're getting intimate, intimate, intimate with the person, do you know you people share feelings? You should know you your friends. Even though you're in Rubo Haji and you know like this person is not dating your friends with benefits, but the moment you're seeing that person with another person, you feel it. It's not cool. It's not cool. No, no, no. You should know your place in someone's life. Ah. If you're someone who has to involve feelings, don't do it. Wait for the right person. Stay celibate till when it's time for you to meet the right person. But if you can manage to to engage in it without emotions, have fun. But if you can't, like you are, you need emotions. Just end at home. Now it's time. <laughs> like. I don't know. I don't know. For some of the GCs, we want money for soft life. Travel the world and go to like a restaurant. Somebody shout an amen to that. Amen. I would shout. Amen. Hey. You person I talk about. Maybe that's right now. Amen. He said amen and I shout for you. For you, you millions. They are here telling us that if you have money, they want money to save to build a house. Ninuwe shamba. Niyanz niyanz niwe shamba. The part of family are for who. But right now with the Gen Z's, right now with the technology, kuna patata kuna gambling, uneza ingia pale hizo sites, kuna vieta, uneza chiza hizo virtual games. Now you get instant cash. Kama mimi unadhani bona ni naenda naivasha. Kuna kitu inaitwa a vieta kwa hali. Kuna si oshosho. Hata unajua oshosho. Kenya, kama unatumia pesa hili sa hizi, uko wewe peke yako kama mko achache. So many people. Watu wanatumia pesa peke. Na bado Eh uh, unajua with Gen Z getting instant money is not that difficult right now with the gambling stuff na pia they are this long long term we are not on the same page we are on the same yeah. page Gen Z are suffering people don't have money lakini au kupata ni rais listen you know Gen Z wana cheseka but Friday utawasta wanalewa yeah that's true that's a fact ni upo na toa we can't even talk about posts. I'm going to make streaks and post stories and the content. Then on Monday, we will be on the show. We are going to 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 be on the show. Ebu mazi hapo kwa comment section mazi ya mtanuwe watu alieta ni nini 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 Kwa ni nini millennials Kwa ni nini millennials ya jinsi batu I have a screen 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 I
have a sprinkle of millennial in me to be honest like an entire sprinkle okay what I'm, what I'm meaning is that gambling easy bit was alone unaona easy bit me by the niko na madeni mingi sana at least nime nimepigiwa juzi ati nilipe tu niko na deni elfu mbili nimeambiwa lipa tu 800 alafu tutakusamea sitaki kuwataja alafu pia leo hasina fani kwa hapo unalipa alafu tena unaongezewa nini but but gen z wana jeka pressure mob sana because we okay let me just ask I, you i feel let like we have a reunion in the house no 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 you're yeah. like talking like no this. we are putting so much pressure no <laughs> uh-huh. we are putting that's so much that's so shit <laughs> you know what it's fine so no 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 don't apologize <laughs> we are putting so much pressure on ourselves life is yeah. relax let me ask him a question you're a gen z like yeah. let's say you get You get right now this moment right now mm-hmm. I give you or we get 100k and give it to you 100k what would you do with it kitu hapo za yenye inaweza napotea kwa hapo napotea 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 actually that's what you are saying mwili lazima ipo juu ya bonde napotea kwa hapo the world and go to you know I I I I scroll on you know he's not responded I passed the whole disappear disappear too somewhere Maldives Naivasha I'm going to Naivasha so that I'll get you help me somewhere Ah uh-huh. so, so uh, but I do Naivasha ni a small percentage unaweza mm-hmm. piga nao unaweza piga nao pole given that yeah. Gen Z we want to enjoy the soft life we also want to have those experiences you, see, you we want, want to, to travel the world you know me sometimes I found I feel uh, my fellow Gen Z on the airport taking up plane as a for you get him una I feel like you guys why are you traveling Gen Z Gen Z how I wanna pass up because no money wants to go to a place where it's appreciated not just thrown around money wants to in a, let's the, the, the fact that we want soft life and we want money in attack in a place to be respected i get like 100k in my hands right now i sit i want to double it i don't want to spend all of it and then i remain broke again so when you get money you don't want to travel you don't want to, you don't want no. to go to high end restaurant i'm not t- i mean that you can do no let's go chakula in awaka unasikia you might want to You have just done an experiment right now. This, this is Gen Z, right? Yeah. When they when Gen Z gets money, it's not just spend. But for me a small percentage, you need to invest. Ah uh, no, I didn't you invest my investment in Jamaica. Not even in Mr. Right now it's only for day. Inazalisha. Instantly. Uh-huh. Actually in, in our era we need to invest. You need to go to invest in your early 20s. Yeah. You know? But let me let me ask. We invest in every money that we get right now. We invest on them. We start See your we start buying shares yeah. and all that. Tutafika parties to zuku kupata midlife crisis. When utakuwa You know these Lisa, people Lisa. with clubs. Nani ya savara limba balance balance. So you need to balance. You need to have fun and also be wise. Yeah. And I get see you know we also have to be sister. Yeah, the camera. <laughs> so apart from just spending money in this you should also have to that. I think we should one thing we should talk actually not for space gap. We should also actually talk about financial literacy because some of us are I'll be there for financial. Literacy. Some of us are expecting with our idea for but yeah, ni kakati ya kuna. But you're an expert, not a gen- our fellow gen- No, 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 no. I'm an ex- I'm a self-proclaimed <laughs> expert. Some of us are doing this course because they're doing the university yeah. because of the society part. Is it part? But some of us are doing some uh, of us are doing this course for the course right now people are doing up up uh, there because of the society only to our hopes only are going to find for something marketable they will try to dance ki uno pa le tiktok also like for me it is because courses mingi what are the wrong courses in the music like it's a your society will be massive come on come education come education, I had some education. Some. you know education is a calling education is a vocation it's a vocation it's a calling ni wito ni kitu mmejitolea lakini now you get into campus you find that the course manze kwa mwalimu nenda kushika ubao pale nenda kusimbora na watu sio wa kepret so the preps vitu kama hizo alafu pia unaangalia teacher una unarudi kama high school kwa sababu unasoma hizo vitabu they don't do they read those books they do they read up the library but after so many years after so many years you don't read like najua content itakuwa hapo yeah mwalimu wetu akem 
in high school drug chemistry and andika to go board he has no book he just said no money calculator easy to easy calculations is a log table is here and it was up on the actually our chemistry yeah. teacher was that's mad it's like wait wait what on a sugar did you carbon did you those it was they talk about those carbon they didn't want a magic to check so i said is all in a period of time ndipo <laughs> 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 a pilot actually that's what it is what do you mean you were raised to happen because me is well, okay, okay, so cool. what do you want to do when you grow up when i at, I when i was a child oh i remember at some point i wanted to be a lawyer okay what about wait, you wait wait wait, 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 wait. <laughs> give me give me time uh-huh. i they asked me and i said i wanted to be a lawyer but then again i got to a point where i wanted to be a musician trust me the in support look at you now but <laughs> If you want to be to mbio mbio utafuta tu society kama kila But I think for Gen Z we when they are more exposed to these things let's say when you interact with your phone you will find more things kuna vitu kama robotics ukianza kwa na hiyo interest kwa hizi robotics kutengeneza ma machines so you can get a, an idea ama clue such that when you go to join campus ama university uh, you can want to do unajua engineering kuna various branches yeah. so unaweza fanya hiyo na electronic engineering kuna mechanical engineering kuna ile ile electronic engineering kuna marine engineering so vitu kama hizo so i have one genesis manze eh, just be exposed to these things there are many courses that you can do see is the society yeah. Ati, utotuetu, na pasifi ati mtoto wetu wenye tumekutoa lazima urudi ukwe kama daktari lazima ukose malaria mm Man, moving on another thing genesis don't allow pressure on them yeah so true so, they put i think it's a good thing about this is middle of america their mental health fast yeah. if it's stressing you it's giving you depression you're out if it costs a piece that's expensive manje says if i go leo is you tadi ntakamshosho ntakani especially madam manje jenzi manje or out in your brain. Yeah. Do you think that? that's actually good? And I, I don't think where people are getting depression because one thing I know about Gen Z is you can't you can't you can't pressure them on doing something if they don't if they don't. Especially that's why even some of them on a concern with their parents and now millennials on a kuja katikati. You know you're supposed to be to respect yeah, your parents. You have all that shit. But my my parents is not respecting me. Yeah. Mm. It goes parents forget. You know I I, I told myself a few days ago or weeks. I think I think millennials are made a with fear. Listen. You know una, una leona kiboko. Was a way to wali to raise to kwa na respect. Una na to kwa quiet and necessary but how often is of it do they respect us <laughs> yeah that's true you get they teach us not to take what does not belong to us until you go for the pressure of pocket money they take it and keep it that take the, what again, you know there's that pressure of moving out of your parents house when everyone is is having right now yeah. because you're not feeling you know, your pressure you keep go home you just need to yeah. yeah and i think that's something about this this nile if it's not the way as they did you can't just dis- disrespect me and sit there and have a conversation yeah. with you stop living in delusion i'm too kind of and by the way i think that journalist really cost the media because that's the segment they had planned for at that time did they, how did they replace it and they actually me, as a journalist i was told you're supposed to have an agreement with the interview the, interview, the interview yeah. Yeah. of what stop I don't know what happened but it's okay. On our last topic of the day. They love God but being religious is out of their blood. First of all what is being religious? 
hiyo kukuwa na hiyo kufanya kama for example hiyo story za huyu mmoja this people who are coming na shaka hapa pasta sama kenzi na watu hiyo pasta anakuambia do this don't do this don't do that yeah, I think for Jesus is the lot don't eat don't eat but being religious unaona ina cost watu wa shaka holo shaka hola sorry some bodies some like bodies uh, for example females they were sexually assaulted in, yeah. as they were doing the autopsy so being religious is not something like all about you what? so for me i think that's true. do you go to church i go to church i'm a catholic the catholic sorry so you're religious yeah i'm religious so you're but with, you're with, religious you are religious you are, you are among the few a few Jesus that still go to church i go to church because right now, okay personally personally i go to church because sunday uko pale kidadi umetini unafikiria economy ile iko mbaya mzee seri tu ende kanisa hata usikuwe masaa muona so you go to church with kuma tai so you go to I was really waiting no. for you to say that people no, go to church to pastor. I go to church to pastor. I believe in God. Networking. Look, I believe in God. Church to pastor. Connection. Kuta. You know, you know, you have to start a girlfriend. This is your only way. You see, my vision is back. Talk to them. Back. Abu ko abu. I love another thing with Gen Z. I don't know if this happens to you. Uko na ile app ya Bible kuti. Lakini ile notification ikikuja uko pale TikTok, uko pale IG, eh? Ikikuja guilty as fuck. Guilty as fuck. Listen, I know. You got actually my Bible than the text. I have a real Bible. Oh, Bible I have a real Bible. How do you open the Bible? My Bible. Mm. Mm, once in a while. When last did you read? When last I read my Bible? Mm-hmm. I think it was and what last you think? week. Last I was week. reading the book of Exodus. I read from chapter 1 to chapter 4. It was the what story does it say? of uh, oh my god. It was I think if about the king if it's not keep it for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you know something you can about things. I say it. Your life. And you just think about king. And of course Exodus. Chief, what, chief, no, it was about Moses. Exodus was about Moses when he was born and the mother to Ah, that thing we didn't see. <laughs> have you ever been in this situation where your phone does not have space but you want to install an app? Then it turns out it was a reposter. Bible app now, seventh day advance and then it seemed not. You know, I, I get another Gen Z, you are <laughs> with a personality, they have become astronauts, this is horoscopic. What's your sign? You are be behaving that because you are Gen Z. I'm a cancer. You are behaving that because you are a Leo. I don't do that, I'm a cancer. <laughs> I, I don't personally I am I am angry at cancers. They don't like talking about their feelings. I have learned that even not even What's your horoscopic sign? I am a cancer. Why are you not talking to me? You do what, what about you? I don't think what's, what's your I'm a Libra. Libra. I'm a Gemini. Libras like talking about their feelings. Libras are very open. Yeah. They're very calm. Cancers don't talk about their emotions. They do not. I do that keep it to myself. Yes. I, I, I have two cancers in my my life me, 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 i can't i can't i can't really tell people i can't judge their characters based on it okay. i'm not very i'm not very profound the hierarchy sign even doing me. how leos behave how mm. me too i was actually behave. having a conversation with my cousins and i learned that because i had one friend who didn't want to talk about his emotions then i have the, a cousin who they share the, the same birthday month they're the same she doesn't like talking about her emotions this friend of mine here i have met him talked to him once in a while he doesn't like talking about his feelings i don't talk about my feelings <laughs> you guys you see the conversation you're having right now you just stated that you guys you know to me talk about the topic we're not talking about our signs and everything <laughs> Me, the one thing I know about Gemini is they like attention. Actually, you know, you know, Gemini's are born between E month and Elisha. It's nine, you know, since the Gemini is Elisha, and the Gemini is like love and attention. And a lot of celebrities they had, okay, they had Gemini. your birthday, their birthday before. Mm-hmm. That's that. Thing. I think that thing is true. How to put on the you are saying that it doesn't seem to do anything with your character you are lying okay it does but we are it told does. not to really rely heavily but you know, on it they, they like when you want to me jump from religion to to her, to those signs zodiac mm-hmm. signs meaning we are we are we are putting like spirituality and zodiac signs on one level no spirituality is all the way here zodiac sign is, sign. Zodiac sign is nowhere to be found within exactly yeah. because i think religion there is people who are religious kuna how they are spiritual manifest how manifest how you are going to kuna mkanga asubuhi wamewasha sijui vitu those are i think those are the people who believe in zodiac signs 
This is how we'll be doing it, okay? okay if if it's it's never ever have, if you are I have it's you raise your hand up. So if it's never no, no like this oh if you have or don't raise your hand. So if yeah. it's you have okay? Okay, let's get into it. Are you guys ready? <laughs> Come on live. No, no. I, it's a game. Say no, it's sour. Yeah, it's it. and how will they learn from Okay, first of all, never have I ever laughed to a person because they were disabled laughed at a disabled person yeah i never could. okay are you serious they can't lie okay like in a meme okay, in real life, life in real life oh, also in a meme okay meme meme, meme. Uh, as a way we share. are you sure you've never shared any meme that in a body in shape a body <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that's so bad. Okay, just in a meme. For me, it's just a Nikki Tito, so I mean, it got me. Okay, never have I ever tell, tell someone he or she looks good, of which actually he or she doesn't. You lied. How do I look? I panicked. I panicked. Same. Mimi, I can explain. I can't 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 explain. I Personally for me, I, I like skinny trousers. So I'm too kids. I put on a card. He told me he was a size of a camille stuff. Share girl. Okay, moving on. Never have I ever used an AI to solve my assignments. I hope our lecturers are not watching. <laughs> Personally, I go, I visit the library, I interact with my books. You've never so used an AI? I never use an AI. For real? At a chat GPT is in account. Me, I'm guilty. I have. No, not a Snapchat AI, my AI app. Bye, ma. Me, I'm actually, I'm not a man. Kila, kila, who text? I'm like, hold up. Me, I'm actually, I was, I was, I was, I was, I was having a relationship issue and I went to consult, I went to consult my AI. Uh-huh. That thing was giving me advice. But I'm like, okay, I'm right, I'm chatting with a robot. You can't tell. You're not even you're not relating to what I'm talking about. You just it doesn't The confidence even how to text it. Me, I just can't. Another one. Never have I ever mm-hmm. lied to a conductor that I've paid. The, never have I lied to a conductor that I've paid that I've been paid bus fare mm-hmm. of which actually I fixed the Mpesa message. Mm-hmm. Asinemu. Mimi sije. Unaweza kupiga. You have. He didn't confirm. Okay, my hands were tied. Me, that's what I can say. What do you mean? Okay, this this the first thing I raised, I raised, I could have really there's a fair in Gaffi, I can exaggerate about because I got to the con. And for me being a person who I am, I never complained. It I was like, okay, I'm sending you. Actually, I reversed it. 
ni live reverse 456 okay. because mtaka yote uko sawa yote ulituma fa kaambia ongeza kwanza niambia pia ni sura zilikuwa ni kwa chwani <laughs> mimi kuna siku nilikuwa ni na Nairobi hapo kutoka hapa nimepanda zile Manchester so I was seated see you see that hapo hapo kwa driver sasa uh-huh. kwenye nyuma uh-huh. I was seated there then the conductor kwa nyuma akaniambia ambia watu wa mbele wanipitishie pesa yao si mimi ni watapi hivi wamenipitishia wamenipitishia tena wapo wamenipea nikapea na yao kuna mtu alikuwa amepea na 1000 moja nikapewa peana balance buda nilipatiwa 900 shillings na sasa hizo nilikuwa naenda Nairobi ndugu yangu nilishukia hapo itedi yangu hapo itedi hapo itedi ndio nilishukia hivi nikashuka oh my why would you go kwa siku yangu sema kitu kwa siku hai kwa siku ya kulifoa alifoa issues wewe ni pia ni pelo kasi ni pelo pelo hasi Miss Kona, Miss Kona. I'm watching you. Tafadhali msinipige. Sinipige. Okay. The last one. Never have I ever break someone's relationship. Okay, parents. What does he mean like friends? Any relationship, any relationship. I think I did na na sipanga kuona kuona ona ona break relationship with friends hadi ki break the friendship when you fake friend ukikuja we have friends and afuweza kuweka siasa so we can break up you are a fake friend anyway never have i ever break some some people's relationship yeah how manze the way i'm cute many girls tell me lakini wana kishuka kidogo nimevunja ndoa ya wengi kutoka mbele akakuja akampata yeah na kuna like circle ilibadilishwa kitambo and a new ownership na katiba inasimwa na mtu mwingine tofauti and yeah no discussion of that you guys yeah evil you are not evil but change you lakini inakuanga tamu inakuanga tamu nile nile ni shamba la na yule ana una ile context yenye amna kitu lakini mnajua tu hii kitu tunacheza inakuanga tamu There is that sweetness when you're breaking someone's relationship until it's yours being broken. That's when you play the victim on a tour of how it feels. I think when you when you are breaking someone's supposed some relationship, we don't tend to put like ourselves in their feet. Yeah, in their shoes. It's not quite selfish. Yeah. That's just up. And that's the end of our game time today. Thank you very much guys for watching and that's about game time. And thank you very much for listening and sharing your views on our today's show. Mm-hmm. It has been very amazing with you guys. Thank you guys for having for coming. I'll be very happy to share to share again our experiences and our for opinions sure. next time, right? For Will sure. you guys be available? Will you come? Yes. I'll be there. For real. Okay. Okay. I'll, be there. okay. I'll not come and talk. Like it's for you can because sababu ni kobasha. So many times is the thing you are shooting this for people are going to Naivasha but i think maybe you you be watching it Naivasha Naivasha is capable to support the Naivasha sorry for you so guys thank you very much for watching and make sure you subscribe to our channel and share with your friends i will be your host Brian Lovegood catch you on our next episode bye bye adios